struggle to get that leg up a bit higher. I should remove fitness out of Naughty Foodie Fitness immediately. Only be here for you. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I can't play guitar. Today I'm going to be doing a Legend London haul. Just before I turn this camera on I thought to myself how am I actually going to do this video because I have only done one clothing haul before which was for my protein and from what I can remember it was pretty hard to film because I didn't really know where to put the camera so I can't say I've had any more practice since that video so I really hope that I can show off these jeans as best I can. Who, what, where, why? If you've never heard of Legend London, they are essentially my now new favorite jean. I'm basically someone that's literally always just worn jeans from Topshop. Have tried a trillion different jeans and I couldn't say that I've found any other jeans that fit better than Topshop before I tried on Legend London. So yeah, I've essentially got six different pairs that I am going to try on for you. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy this haul. I feel like it's uh, pretty self-explanatory. I'm just gonna show you guys how they fit. If you haven't yet liked this video, please my friends, just, just hit that button. Just hit that thumbs up button. It really helps me out and it really doesn't take that much time out for your day. So if we're talking about how much effort to impact that this has, there's a very low effort on your part and a huge impact on mine so I would really really appreciate if you liked the video I'm gonna stop going on about you hitting that like button now because I am assuming that you have now liked the video so thanks a lot and I really hope you enjoy this video I've now got kind of like a bit of a leg cramp anyway well that's not great Steph like really gonna be showing off the jeans like that I mean do you guys need to see my face you just really need to see the jeans Comment down below if at this point you're slightly worried about me doing a jeans haul and really I should just stick to motivation for the nation. <gasps> uh, right, first pair of jeans that I've not actually even tried on yet myself, the ripped black women's jeans. They smell fresh. <laughs> yes guys, I do smell my jeans, I don't know about you. So yeah, they essentially come like this. They have the logo on the back. They have some rips. I mean, this will be awkward if they don't fit. Oh, I really like these. Okay, literally what I love about Legend London is they are super high-waisted and they stretch so well. They've got pockets at the back. And yeah, <laughs> they are super stretchy. So these are the dark grey wash, which are personally my favourite, like, I absolutely live in these jeans. They are so, so, so comfortable. The only thing I would say is that they don't actually have front pockets, so I do find myself doing this quite a lot, but there are pockets at the back. I am a waist 26, length 28, I believe. Yeah, length 28 in all these jeans. Normally, the jeans, I'm between an 8 to 10. You honestly can do full-on squats in these jeans. And I don't believe they give any kind of weird camel toe around this area. Yeah. Next, I'm gonna try on the dark blue ripped jeans. The logo at the back, pockets at the back, and rips at the front. Okay. These are the dark blue ripped jeans. Oh, I love these. I feel like they all have a slightly different elasticity to them. I feel like these are by far the most elastic. I'm really shit at getting the angle, but I do feel that these jeans do give you a good, a good curve. I feel like the pockets are high, so they don't cover your bum curve and they instead make your bum look a little more voluptuous. Fit really well, I feel like they're not those jeans that you have to like keep 
like pulling up they just you put them on and they they just stay so plain white no rips i feel like white's an always risky color so next i've got the white on now like i said before all of these jeans are slightly different in how stretchy they are and i can definitely tell that these out of all the jeans that i have tried on are the least stretchiest like i can't really get my leg any higher which isn't to say they aren't comfortable but they definitely aren't as stretchy you can still move just struggle to get that leg up a bit higher <laughs> not recommend these if you are looking for like, the stretchiest jean because that would definitely be the dark ripped so yeah they've got the logo at the back which obviously stands out a lot more on the white the riskiest jean color though to wear like i am pretty clumsy yeah i feel like you wouldn't catch me wearing white jeans too often but i do feel that they are kind of like a nice option if you want to look a little dressier i know that i am trying all these on with just a sports bra but obviously with like a nice top and heels that's not to say you could not look glam you know you don't have to look all like active wary i'm trying on the lighter wash in the ripped jeans my hair is an absolute mess so this jean definitely feels more like a jegging again this material like see what i mean i can fully i feel like i could do yoga in these ones those of you who want to be doing like activity <laughs> Yeah, I wasn't lying when I said that these are pretty jeggony, you know? <gasps> I should remove fitness out of Naughty Foodie Fitness immediately. <laughs> See, these jeans allow me to do my kind of standard, if you follow me on Instagram, my standard flamingo leg pose. It's where I try to tense my hamstring and get that muscle to come around a bit more with the white jeans i was kind of restricted to this kind of movement whereas with these i can fully go down you know what i like about the legend london rip jeans is that they don't go overboard on rip on the rip i know it's partly my fault but you know when you put your foot into a jean and then you just stretch the rip even more that you end up with jeans that are essentially just holes and you're basically just showing half your leg um i feel like they're there is enough rip for them to not look like you've just cut two holes into your jeans but then not too much that you might as well just be wearing shorts if you know what i mean they've got a good a good balance these are the light blue denim ones and i believe that leads me on to the khaki jeans i've not actually tried this but i've been told that it fits a little different to the other ones slightly nervous this isn't gonna fit me in terms of how this is fitting, the material is very, very thin in comparison to the other ones. I've definitely used a different material here. <laughs> I just scared myself. No, that didn't just rip. That was the zip. Definitely a lot more of a struggle to get these on. However, they do fit. <laughs> you guys were doubting, weren't you? I know. Okay, they fit pretty much like a glove. <laughs> so these are the khaki. The material is definitely a lot thinner though than the other jeans. I do like these though. Yeah, I'm a fan of these. I did initially think that they were too small, but they, they do fit pretty well. I think that's literally the last pair of jeans. I hope I've like said everything that I had to say. And that's it. <laughs> I thought that there would be more or that this would go on for longer, which is kind of a good thing because my battery's dying. But I hope you've enjoyed this jeans haul. I know that it's a little bit different. Um, I'm falling off the bed as I talk. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this gave you a better insight into Legend London jeans. As I said, they do all fit slightly different. And if I was going for what i personally find fits best for me i would go with the dark blue ripped jeans or as i said these light blue which feel a lot more like jeggings they're definitely a lot stretchier than the other ones <laughs> although with that said i really 
<laughs> I really like the dark grey and the black. <laughs> so really, have I even helped? I hope you've enjoyed this video regardless and you found it somewhat entertaining. I would highly recommend these jeans to any and everybody. Believe you me, you are going to walk out there and feel confident within yourself. Again, really hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks a lot for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I guess I'll catch you guys very soon. Again, if anybody has any recommendations for any video that you'd like to see me film or challenge, anything, even a topic you'd like for me to discuss over, I don't know, some food, let me know, write it down in the comments below. I'm always happy to try new things and case up for all. <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching. Keep smiling and stay nice, my friends. Forgot to get a thumbnail for the video. What do I even do for a thumbnail? Do I like look surprised at how stretchy they are? Show the ribs? Do I pose in them? Show the hole? I just don't know. YouTuber struggles. I'm done trying to get a, a thumbnail. Getting a thumbnail is hard. I'm hungry. I th it's too early to even call this lunch, so I'm just gonna call it a second breakfast. I'm bloody exhausted. <laughs> okay, bye. I wish I'd got my mum to teach me how to play something, and then I could have made this a half decent intro.